Renan Hollandaw, Gakrod, or Krihu Dola Janu, Fanak Funeske, Tamil Fada, Torpedo, Akyolu, No Pilu, No Barna Faraga, Gagasta, No Imakt Gan Lorager. Marjalarnach and Yarnu, the Scrutia Shaw, the Sim War Fiblion, because Kern the Mine, Dual War Siskel. Near Yarvi Holland a Rio, Kayaku a Ro, no Nakro, and IRB Parchak on. Ak washed the mine on Tanyam, the Fenian Ramer, or Kashas and Tanyam Shinlesh, Gijian La Tanyuan. Harn a Brittany Spesh of War in Holland. Wool Ulfus aid. Nor a dolem she had not come a direct at the cudge in a man of his Athenian ram, a fear vagarch. Bwed dove ratcha, a hark had long in the howl of the Bratania, got on pull. The British, they're watching these experiments taking place in the open. British diplomats in London write to Washington and say this torpedo ship, as they call it, is capable of fantastic power. And they don't mean that as a compliment. That is a sign of their fear. So uh, they're very concerned. They're looking at it as a weapon of war that is meant for them. The principal spy for the British was a man known as Henry Le Caron. He was French-Canadian. And he was mostly in Chicago, in Illinois. He was a doctor, so he said. And he persuaded these very hard-headed, skeptical Clan de Gale people, Devoy included, that because he was French, that he shared their hatred of Britain. Henri Le Caron, Marabarite Nier, Ak Thomas Miller Beach and Tanya McCart of Ear. Near Enti, O'Donovan Rossa, no Devoy, or a Kurhega is far, Lahera, a Skilu Seer, O Lancashire Nebratania. Hog Le Caron, Nyard Kestina, Modula Husage, and Kestia Hogiakta, or Kor Ekahu, the rare Mo Hogiakta, Egonovan Rossa, nor a Var Ekahu, the rare Venta, Follatula, Devoy. Or Kyondan a Kestina, the Howakti Ux Behontasi, a Hog Le Caron, na Kest and Kachahish. Kurwin Lake or Kate Devoy at their dayhead, like a shask a million dollar or an over and shaw, like a snocker on cad, no one to do this again. Like Shiny Togo Prince in a spear dory or like Karen. Hogga Weistri Britannica or the Hado, Gach Balakaro Ega, Kurdish Jack, like a scris a Yanu. And Hydrev in their Holland, Agas a Hakihis Nafinini. This wild scheme had to do with a manufacturer of a submarine torpedo boat with which it was intended to inflict terrible damage on the British Navy underwater. Holland still wanted to continue his invention and his discovery and an expansion of his ideas because now he went from the one to Finney and Ram, boat number two, to three, and now he's like on a roll. And he is still in this process of discovery. And the Finneans are like, stop, this is it, this is perfect. We now have the weapon that we need to rid ourselves of the British Navy and get our Irish independence. In Canada, a politician and a former Irish revolutionary uh, named uh, Terence Darcy McGee was murdered at around this time. Uh, some years later, a doctor in Chicago uh, was killed in a feud. So in the middle of all of this faction fighting, in the middle of all of this division, in the middle of all this violence is John Holland, who, whatever his political goals may have been, we know that he had one important goal, which was to get his vision, to get his invention funded and operating. I don't think he wanted to be caught in the middle between the Chicago wing of Clan Gale and the New York wing, between O'Donovan Rasa and Devoy. This was not in the plan. I think as he looked at the level of violent language, he may have thought, if I make a bad decision here, my life could be in danger. <laughs>